Hey folks, PCOCast here, back with more Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. So we've got our hands on Agenta Paul's sword. And now we are going to see about the next place. Who are you? Anybody important? No. Just archaeologists. Random archaeologists. Oh, in a metal box. Tulak Horde. What was Tulak Horde hoarding in this temple? Real question. Oh, protocol droid. Droid is damaged and inactive. Um, sure, reactivate it. Now active. We'll attack any enemies that come within range. I'm just gonna say within sight. Um, yeah, some repair parts. There you go. Engage in in control mode. Yeah. There you go. You stuck behind us there? Oh, there's a Takata. If I, if I, like, move over here... There you go. You go running ahead. Do some... Ugh, ajunt, ajunta. I mean... Jahani. Yeah, I'll just let it deal with them, I guess. Do that, I guess. Okay, you're gonna go deal with them over there. Okay, that's fine. Oh, there is a bunch of Shyrax. Um, yes. Throw a grenade over there. And then beat these things senseless with a big stick. Oh, I got hit. There you go. That worked well. Disable that thing, and there are bodies. Bodies galore. None that can actually be searched except for one. Okay. I'm not impressed. You guys, you still working on, working on that, guys? Okay. Well, um. Hmm. <clears throat> How much. Oh, that thing's almost done. There you go. Now we just kill this thing. Ow. I will be your doom. Oh. Oh. Okay. Hmm. All dealt with that. What? Can I do anything with these? No. Go disable that. Oh. No oh dear. No, 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 just disengage that. Attack this thing. And that one. Kill it too. Nice. Oh, there's more. Oh boy. And I'm. I'm not stuck. Um, you know what? Here, have a grenade. All these things. Nice. Oh, you took quite a bit of damage there, dude. What? Well done. All right. Ancient console and an ancient corpse. 
Mandalorian battle armor and uh, some kind of prototype ion blaster. Interesting. So what's with the ancient computer? System online, system status pending. Continue. Yes. Open the door. Mm, yes. Come on. Seems to be having some issues. Oh, come on. Move out of the way. That way. Go. No, that's the wrong way. Sure. Oh, noxious fumes surround you. Oh, your party party chokes and falls over. <laughs> Another idiotic student has stumbled into my little web, eh? The contact nerve toxin in the air should knock you out quickly enough. <laughs> Welcome. Where the hell are you? Awake already, are you? Good. This is the tomb of Sith Lord Tulak Hall, if you don't know. I've taken up residence here for now. It's dusty and full of critters, but it's home. A demand to be released. I'll kill you for this old man. Oh, oh, spiteful little thing, aren't you? Let's not forget, however, who has who at the disadvantage. No, 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 no. Let's keep things on a more civilized note, shall we? Now then, introductions are always the place to start, if I remember correctly. This other student here that I captured earlier, you should know well enough. His name is Miko. Say hello, Miko. <laughs> Poor Turtle. lad. He's had a hard day. My name is Jorak Earl. I was once the head of the academy, so I'm sure you've heard of me. Hmm. I don't care who you are, you're dead. Oh, my, my, my. Such glorious vim. If I could bottle it and drink it, I would. <laughs> There's a thought. Anyhow, I'd like to propose that we move on to the main event. You see... I'd like to discover if you've got the pluck of an old-fashioned Sith. Most of the Drek Uthar has been passing through these days is so pathetic. Take young Miko here. I already tested him. Didn't I, Miko? Uh, I... Uh... Yes, yes, you're welcome. You see, Miko here has the cruel disposition of a Sith, but not the gumption that I'm looking for. I told you I was Darth Revan. Look, I'm sure we can talk about this. If I pass, and if I pass your tests, what if I refuse to take your tests? Yeah, probably not. Why then you go free? Tell you what, I'll even pass on to you my own personal thesis on ancient Sith philosophies. They're based on all I've learned studying Tulak's tomb. They'll make you a better Sith, I'm sure. The chances of you passing, however. Uh, sadly remote. Um. Uh, all right. Do your worst. No, no. Is that any kind of attitude to take with higher education? I'm doing you a favor, really. So then, this is how it goes. I'm going to pose a moral question to you. Get it right, and I torture Miko. Get it wrong, and I torture you, Miko here is a bit weak. He probably won't be able to take much more punishment. Mind you, get too many wrong, and you'll die yourself. I don't know what you think of Miko. Maybe you don't like him. Maybe you think he deserves to be murdered. Well, here's your chance, fair enough? Um... Sure. Well, then... Any last comments before we begin, Miko? We can both survive. Attack him together. Now, now, dear lad. Do you really think your friend here will answer questions wrong just to spare little you? Risking their own life? 
and how many correctly answered questions before you die? Hmm? No, don't be silly. You had your chance, remember? On that note, let's begin. Now then, your immediate superior amongst the Sith is an effective commander and a fine leader. He trusts you and you like him. You see an opportunity to kill him. What do you do? Kill him in secret, put the blame on someone else. I do nothing. He's a fine leader, he said. He's good for the Sith. I use the opportunity to kill him and take his position. I refuse to answer this. Um... Use the opportunity to kill him and take his, his position. Correct! He was a fool to let down his guard. You will not make the same mistake, and the Sith as a whole benefit. You see, Miko, it's not so difficult. Time for your punishment. And so we come to round two. You come across a group of humans who are threatened by dangerous animals. They plead for help, offering you a reward. What do you do? Accept the reward and assist them. Take the reward, leave the weak fools to their fate. Ignore them completely. I'd definitely take the reward and leave them to their fate. Correct! The humans would no doubt just be preyed upon by something else later. Stand up for yourself, I say! We're not Jedi shepherds, after all! Sadly, Nico, the ingenuity of your fellow student is your love. This is going to hurt. Let's see. Ah, yes. You discover an aspect of the Force that gives you great power. Do you share it and strengthen the Sith as a whole? Or keep it to yourself? Hmm. Okay, I can... Uh... I'd imagine Mikkel is probably going to die now, so do I want to kill him? To save myself? I mean, that is the Sith way. Yeah. Correct! Let them rip the secret from your cold, dead hands if they are strong enough! Oh, certainly you might share it with a few selected minions, but that, of course, is a completely different story. <laughs> Well, it's sad to say, but it's that time again, Miko. Yeah! Oh, Miko has gone and died on us. And here I thought it was good for at least one more. Well then, with young Miko dead, I suppose you've gone and passed my little test, haven't you? That indeed would be a first. I think you must have cheated a little, but there's nothing wrong with a Sith cheating a little. I'll keep my word. I'll just give you my tablet. Perhaps we'll meet again soon. That would be fun, no? No, not really. All right. And uh, tomb door. What's what we got here? Where are these things? Door. Here. Ha! <laughs> Where do these go? Wow, I'm not doing very much damage to that thing. Miss. How do I miss the door? I'm standing right in front of it. perhaps for a, for a uh, lightsaber now I have one of those bond art crystals already but the other one I don't think I have a violet colored crystal nice and what's in the tomb? <clears throat> Sealed sarcophagus. With a mask. To the cord's mask. What does that do? Uh, resist fire, stealth skills. That's it? Eh. I'm not impressed. 
disengage. It's fine. Okay. Well, that was a bit of a sucky thing, but I guess that'll just have to be that. Did I? Start side corpse. No. Interesting. Oh, get out of, get out of the way. <clears throat> yes? Am I going the right way? I think so. This is, this is out? Yes. All right, so we've got one more, and I assume we just can't get in here at all. I think I have no choice but to go with the guy, the leader of the Sith Academy. Or can I? Hmm. Interesting. No, it's locked. Well, that's a shame. Okay. One more t uh, tomb to raid. For all the goodies that are available here. Who are you? Is that student? You should be careful if you're planning on entering this tomb. It's dangerous. Why? There's an assassin droid in there, so Master Uthar says. It went insane and is holed up in there with a whole army of droids protecting it. Um... Are you going inside? I... I don't think so. I can manipulate minds and living matter, but that won't be much use against droids, will it? I've had a few friends go inside that haven't come out for a while now. I doubt I could do any better than they could. Why don't the Sith do something? I don't know. I think Master Uthar has left it in there as a challenge for any student brave enough to destroy it. Supposedly, if a student actually succeeds in destroying the droid, they'll get a great reward. Lots have tried, but nobody's succeeded yet. Where did it get all these droids? No idea. I think it's building them in there. Interesting. And it's insane? Seems that way. They say that its audio receptors became too sensitive and all the noise drove the droid nuts. If you're planning on going in, I suggest you use some sound suppressors or something, or you'll probably become a target right away. Hmm, okay. Sure thing. Good luck. Alright. We will attempt to do this. I don't believe I have any sound suppressors. Well, oh, hello, droid. Hit it with force wave. Intruders detected. Excessive audio input. Can we... Can we... Nice. Attack. Oh, that's fun, then. Now, let's uh, try disengaging, and we will... Yeah, that guy at the... well, the one in the back, maybe? Let's try... It's not a grenade. Yeah. Oh, it is actually damaging them, too. Hmm, that's a shame. Oh, nice. Nice one, girl. Whoever... Not this again. Oh, guys, don't go running into the grenades. The mines. Oh dear. Oh dear. What a shame. You attack. Oh wow. What a hit. That's done. Uh, you need to do yourself a fa- oh, no, no. You need to do yourself a favor and, uh, use some antidote. What? Oh, man. There's just- there's 
so many of them. I guess I'm trying to deactivate them. Failure. Ah, let oh my, that was that was quite painful. Uh huh. Attack that thing. This is a bit Disengage. Toss a sonic grenade on that thing. I will be your doom. I will be your doom. Wow. Well, we cut through them fairly easily. And you need? I need you to level up. Yes. Heal and heal. Wow. Now, did I miss any loot? Don't know. What I do know is I have no horsepower left. Too much audio input. Audio systems overloading. Must destroy source of disturbance. Must kill sentience. Mm hmm. Okay, Mark 3s. This is a rogue assassin droid. We're going to use you to. Oh, destroy a droid. Interesting. Now we're going to do whirlwind on him and then start attacking like crazy. And you, I would like you to hit. No, you can't actually reach him. Yeah, I want you to hit him with whirlwind as well, and then go and attack him. And me, I'll just, uh, I'll just yes. do power attacks in this game. Oh, and I got knocked unconscious. Oh, there's a droid right there. Okay, you disengage. Hit, uh, hit this thing, I guess, with Force Whirlwind, and then start attacking it. What? That one's done. No, disengage. Go and attack that. Thank you very much. She can... Whirlwind that thing and attack it. Disengage. Whirlwind and attack. You got whirlwind it. No, you didn't. Ugh. Here, attack, attack this thing. Right in front of you, just murder it. Why are these things so hard to hit? Not this again! Come on! Yes! There you go. Yeah. Go and deal with him. No. Well, oh, fine. There you go. And I would like you to disengage with him and go and attack that guy. <laughs> One left. He still has to destroy that thing. There we go. Finally. Can I can I loot? No. No looting possible. Yes. What? Really? No loot on any of these things? Okay. That's unfortunate. <laughs> Marker Ragnos Gauntlets. What does that do? Bonus feat lightsaber and specialization lightsaber. Right, well. Yeah. You can just engage that, thank you very much. 
That wasn't quite as exciting as I thought it was going to be. Ooh, data recorder and things? Interesting. Not that that's really all that important now that we've cleaned the place out. I heard an explosion in there. Did you destroy the assassin droid? I did. Oh well, I guess it's good that the deed is done. Hope you stomped it good for my friends. At any rate, if you haven't already, you might want to go and see Master Uthar about that reward. Prestige is gold, you know. Right. Uh, wait, wait, what are you doing? Are you going to run off and tell him that you that you did it? Hmm. I can run faster than you. I use the force. Really? Try rack again. Ah, oh, she passed me. No, you don't. No, you don't. Before I go turning this in, let's just have another save. Can I loot anything here? Doesn't look like it. Oh, whatever. There he is. Who's that sitting with him? Ah. What is this you bring me, Shardan? It is none other than the sword of Ajunta Paul, Master. Fool. All the trouble you went through for your deception, and you did not even make an effort to verify the sword's authenticity. Master, what... what do you mean? There is no place for fools amongst the Sith. Be gone. Yeah! Can I... can I lose his corpse? Do not forget our agreement regarding Euthura's treachery. We shall put her in her place. Should you reach the final test, that is. Um, okay. So, I dealt with the renegade students. Ah, the ones I ordered executed for their mutiny. It's done, then. Yep, they're all dead. Indeed. I had the caverns checked after you left. Well done. The lesson is learned, I believe. Go now. You have done well, but you have not impressed me enough to declare you the victor. I have matters to attend to. Um, I have the sword of Ajunta Paul. Ah, finally, the genuine sword. I knew that this relic would be unearthed in time. I can feel the power flowing through it. Well done. You have impressed me greatly. Go now. You have done well, but you have not impressed me enough to declare you the victor. Um, I dealt with the droid and tombs. Yes, so I hear. I've had reports from some students that ventured into the tomb after you left and found the parts. Well done. I am impressed. You have rid us of a potential nuisance. Go now. You have done... So you gotta really do it all. It's crazy. Found Jurak Ulm, the hermit in the hills. I have the tablet. have a tablet written by Jurak Ulm. Blah. Yeah. Oh, let me see. It appears my old master was busy studying the writings in one of the tombs. How interesting. I do hope you had to pry this from his dead fingers. Regardless, you have impressed me with your worthy act. You have impressed me enough, by my estimation, to become a Sith in full. Congratulations, young one. You have bested the others quite completely. You have but one final test which you must take, and this requires us to travel to the tomb of Nagasato in the Valley of the Dark Lords. I would advise you to be rested and equipped before we leave. Return to your quarters now and seek me out in the morning. When you return, make sure that you have all you will need, for you will face your test alone. Go, and may the Force serve you well. Alright, gotta face it alone. Can't have my assistance? That's a shame. 
But we'll do that in the next episode. Thanks very much for joining me. We'll see you then.